Now, important step here, we're about to install the newest version of the Ultimatum theme as of April 2015, which is version uh, 3.8.5, point two rather. Now, what you would need to do that, which I'm not gonna do, you'd log into your Ultimatum because I don't wanna share with you my private information, but you'd log into your account, you'd download the theme to your desktop someplace, put it in a safe place so you know where to get it. Then go back to, uh, to the WordPress installation and we're gonna upload the theme. So that's what we're about to do. I already downloaded this. I already logged in with my user information. I paid for the uh, Ultimatum theme, which is a commercial product, by the way. But it's worth every single penny because it's got so many features. It's jam-packed with tons and tons and tons and tons of cool stuff, one step at a time. So I'm going to go back to my WordPress installation. And based on these choices, we want to do something with the theme. As I mentioned earlier, theme is based on these choices are under appearance, appearance theme. Then based on these choices, you'll see it says add new. We're about to add a new theme. I'm going to click right there. Now I can add themes that are free in the WordPress directory. I can search for different themes. So let's say I'm going to, I want to search for a responsive design theme. I'm just giving you a little for instance. So I'm going to type in the word responsive. And this will bring up any kind of responsive design theme, which means it's going to resize itself based on the device that you're looking at. Now, the ultimate theme is a responsive design theme. Now, eventually, I'm going to have a lot of training videos for the top selling themes on Theme Forest. Eventually. Right now, I have a good handful, but eventually, I want to have a good top 20. So the objective here is I don't want to install one of these themes. I want to install the ultimatum theme. So based on these choices, I go to upload theme. I click here, I navigate my way to where I keep the themes, which is inside of my downloads folder, inside of a folder called Ultimatum or wherever you happen to put it. Actually, my mistake on that, inside of Ultimatum here or wherever you happen to put it, and I'm going to install this particular theme. I'm going to click install. It's going to take a second to, if you look down here at the bottom left, it will tell you the percentage that it's taking to get up there. All right. Now, based on these choices, I can go to Live Preview, which we're not going to do. I just want to activate the theme because, of course, the purpose of this course is to share with you how to work with the Ultimatum theme. So we're going to activate. Now, keep in mind, we could have many themes in our WordPress installation, but you can only activate one theme at a time. Now, there are third-party plugins out there where you can switch to different themes on the fly, and, we're, and the Ultimatum theme has a really good tool already built in and enables you to do that. All right, so here's what we need to do. Okay, this is going to tell you a little bit of uh, information about the ultimate M theme, what's new in version 2.8.2. But more importantly, what we need to do is go to the ultimatum tool set. This is where the magic happens, all the back end goodies that come with your ultimatum installation. So we're going to click the ultimatum tool set. Then based on these choices, it's going to say, well, in order to get these goodies, you have to be a registered user. So I'm going to log in with my username and password. It's the same username and password that you got when you bought your theme. The same information you log in with here is the same information that you use here. Okay, so let's do that. Now, if you logged in successfully, you'll get this screen next. Now, this you can leave exactly how it is by default. We're not gonna to touch anything. We're gonna leave this strictly by default and I'm gonna save changes. Okay, so now we're prepared to use and benefit from the ultimatum experience. So in our next video, now that we install the ultimatum theme framework, now you're hearing me say that a lot framework, which means it's a lot more than just a theme. You can basically build a the set of themes and child themes and really cool stuff, which we're going to learn during the course of this video series. So in our next video, I'm going to share with you how the ultimatum theme thinks, what it needs from you and how to make it work. Ultimatum theme is a great theme, but it works very differently than most other themes out there. And if you don't know how it thinks, it's going to be very, very confusing to you. So stay tuned for the next video and I will share with you my understanding of ultimatum theme and how it thinks and how it could benefit you. So stay tuned.